so area of triangle so we know area is equal to half a b sine c but just remember it if you have the angle in between these two line where the two line is known then you can use area so here you see angle in between these two line so you can directly use area so area is equal to half a b sine c right so this is c so this is sine c so if you have angle in between these two line you can directly use so half so this one is uh, the line in between the angle which is 16.2 and 18.4 sine c is 49 so we get 112.482 centimeter square so for this one you also have the angle in between these two lines where it is half so ab is a line in between the angle which is 7 and 10 so sine 1 2 5 so you get 28.670 centimeter square and here so you see here to use area you need to have angle in between these two lines but now you have two angle but you only have one line so you need to find another line but you see here you have this one so if you have one set one opposite set one opposite set and then you have uh, one opposite of what you want to find what you want to find you can use so sign rule so you see here opposite of what you want you see you have this one 10 cm and 35 this is opposite set so you have opposite set opposite of what you wanted to find so you see here since you have this angle you can find this line so this one is x let this one be x so we know sign rule x over sin 60 is equal to 10 over sin 35 so x is equal to 10 over sin 35 times sin 60 which is equal to 15.099 so you get here x is equal to 15.099 So here, to find area, we need to find angle in between the two lines. So you see here, you have this line. So you need to find angle in between the two lines. So you don't have this angle. So this angle is equal to 180 minus 60 minus 35, which is equal to 85 now we can find area which is equal to half so the two line in between angle which is 10 and 15.099 sine so here is 85 so we get 75.208 centimeter square